What's up guys, it's Jacus back with another Dawn of War Soulstorm 1v1 video. Today's video is going to be more of a mid-level game, and I'll explain why at the end of the video, perhaps, if I remember to. So basically here we have um, a bunch of squares playing as Necrons on the top side, and his opponent is ALL, playing as Space Marines on the bottom side. And the map that they're playing on is Fata Morga. So L is going to open up with, th uh, yeah, two scouts, uh, the second builder on the way, and then makes the third scout squad afterwards. And getting the chapel barracks, no generator. We love to see that. We love to see the space room players not make the generator. First of all, uh, queue up a generator. They're going to go, what, wait, wait, why is he going force command first? What? Position secure. No. No LY. Anyway, back over the top side, Necrons, he is going to open with five generators. Uh, one, two, all the scarabs by the looks of it. Yeah, all the scarabs first, and then hopefully some Necron uh, warrior squads to follow afterward. So, yeah, already, like, um, if you haven't seen Dazzy uh, Minister's video, he brings up a good point about one of my Space Marine build on this video <laughs> sorry i just i just remember that video and i laugh on it fondly but um in that video i i kind of say to go force commander first but really you don't want to do this because the force commander actually takes quite a long time to come out it's better to go for the space marine squad first they're much quicker to get out and then you have some kind of like uh you know defense in your base i guess yeah, see, now the Space Marine squad comes out. So he was going to go for a Space Marine squad anyway. He should have done the Space Marines first. Also, we're not really seeing some uh, listening points get built. I see it's because L dropped the plasma generator before building the listening post, not uh, post, posts. So, yeah, you really want to just get the listening posts up first before building the generator. You don't need the power so early. Um, you can just you know, delay the plasma generator a little bit. But anyway, that's enough critiquing of the Space Screen player. Let's look at the Necrons. Let's see how he's doing. One, two, three, five, six. Yeah, good. He's got all the, uh, the six generators, pretty standard for uh, Necrons in the early game. And then he's getting the summoning core up. So that's pretty good so far. Two, two um, Necron warrior squads out. One thing he could have done as well is just with the scarabs, just you know, send one down early on and maybe try to capture or de get some decaps on SM's points. Necron warriors fighting in melee with the force commander probably not a good idea. In fact, they shouldn't be fighting at all here. They're gonna lose. It's a shame uh, Necrons didn't have a turret ready. Another kind of like a standard you see in this matchup. Fatamorga, you will see the Necron player place a turret in his base just for some extra defense. Wouldn't really be useful right now. But um, yeah, he will lose this point as well. Unfortunate. Now the Necron Lord comes out. Necron Wari is still wanting to fight in melee with this Force Commander. I'm not sure why. He's just letting it go on as well. Uh, but the Force Commander will retreat. I guess he saw the Necron Lord. No, he didn't, but Well, anyway. Taking heavy fire! We are the Space Marines should run. They won't get the decap anyway. The scarabs will just decap Heresy after they've captured it. Yeah, just retreat Marine out of there. Don't deployed. don't take uh, any more casualties than you really need to. But um uh, yeah. Second Space Marine squad comes out now. And actually, L is already going tier 2. Pretty pretty early on, but uh, that's okay. Now Wraith comes out from Necrons. Actually, some flayed ones would be good as well. Unfortunately, the Necron Lord did get caught in melee with the... What the hell? Is that the Chronometron? Oh my god. Anyway. <laughs> um, yeah, so as you saw, the Necron Lord was a bit stunned. He's taken a... A lot of damage there, actually. But um, now we've got this engagement going on. Wraith will tie up these space marines. This squad of marines dangerously low. 
He has to be careful not to lose this one. Well, usually in like these lower level games, uh, some of the players don't really know how to micro properly, but it, it's good to see Al, you know, um, pulling back when he needs to, not uh, mindlessly suiciding his units, which is always good to see. Yeah. Necrolord on Red Health. Also, Armory comes up for L as well. Um, Necron player builds more generators. Not sure how to feel about this. Plus 70 is pretty solid, I think, for tier 1. Maybe you could even go plus 80, but the more you build, the more expensive it is, and the more you delay your tech. Especially since Space Marines is already tier 2, Necron needs to follow up. But look at all these plasma guns. Absolutely wiping the floor with these Necron Warriors. Yeah. Slaughtered. Um, Four minutes until taken. Necron's army is looking pretty weak, to be honest. Too many space marines and their plasma guns. Necron Lord and Wraith just go down. Sorry, this is so funny. Oh my god, Necrons was just not prepared for this at all. A phase shifter, a solar pulse would have been nice. He actually has the Forbidden Archive, I'm surprised he went for the Chronometron. Yeah, this Gorse Turret won't last long at all. Plasma Guns actually do reasonably uh, good damage on these uh, low armor buildings. Necrons is spitting out more warriors, but uh, they're not going to do anything, to be honest. He just suicides them into this Three superior space marine army, right into the plasma firepower. At this point, actually, I think the square player has already left the game. Um, yeah, nothing was being microed there, so clearly he really disconnected. Ah, that was a bit of a one-sider, but basically, <laughs> this was a viewer submission by, I think, this player, the Space Marine player, it would have been because he did win the game, but there you go. Um, so that's how not to play Necrons, I guess. Don't, uh, don't run into the plasma guns, I don't know, he, he just didn't, yeah. There was enough backdooring from Necrons as well, backdooring is... You want to be doing stalling tactics with uh, Necrons in this matchup anyway. Um, so yeah, there's the military score. Got some resources there. And technology. This video is super short. I didn't know this game was was that short. But um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless, I guess. Um, stay tuned for another video to come very soon after this one since that one actually was so short all right guys take care and i'll see you in the next one peace